Hello, and welcome to day four of our week of button mashing. Let's just pick something at random. I realized that I think I don't have randomized stages on. Oh man, I gotta get to... I think, I think we got it in time. Whew. All right. So, I think that... Uh, we might be able to see a little bit more variety on our training modes and stuff now. We'll see. But yeah, we're just going to get right into it and start playing some games. Keep making sure that we're trying to... Ooh, wow, that is a big... Can we 6P that? Okay, that looks like I am no longer threatened by the uh, bot there. Oh, that just sent through because of the stain. <laughs> Not ideal for us. Gotta do something there. Alright, so we kind of got smoked at the beginning, but we didn't lose too much. I'm just gonna do a heavy sl or a far slash. They don't seem to be able to deal with it very well. Ah, uh, we didn't get a big combo out of that or anything. Okay, they're sort of learning. Oh, they actually went for a contestation there. That was good. Oh, and I'm a little slow. That time I was trying to beat it. Okay, we'll take that. That's fine. Uh, we can, like, try to RC and stuff now, right? To beat that. <laughs> okay, I just kind of thought I would win. I'm not going to lie. Um... I was not expecting the dust to be uh, that much of a tall hitbox, but there it is. Alright, we did terribly and won, but you know, whatever. We'll take it. I kind of just did far slash into fireball, and they didn't seem to be able to deal with it very well. We'll back off here. Uh, I gotta remember that I can try to do that counter hit combo. Yeah. Oh, oh we were slow. Oh, that, that did not work. <laughs> Obviously, that was supposed to be Crow, but the, the problem was largely that I was not entirely sure uh, if I should try to just do a super there, and the indecision kicked my butt. I guess we could have done a 6H there, huh? And I don't know if I can get a 5P there, or a 5K there, but we can try it. I did not know what I could get off of that situation. Again, we can 2H more. Wow, alright. That was an option that was chosen. Uh, I was trying to get the kill, but I probably could have done it with an Arbiter. Man, there's all these little things, huh? Like all these little interactions that I don't understand. This system is such a pain in the butt. I hate this system. All right. Like, at least let people finish their match. You can't have such an important system backing this up. It didn't actually take our training mode. Okay, well, now we know. You can't actually have such an important system with your rating that it can't just finish the match with two players in a room for the three full matches and just kicks you out after one or two games. Like, I don't know. Oh, we got another one. Yeah, let's do some of this. 2H. Let's try to put a little 2H into our lives and see what happens. In addition to, you know, the standard. Ugh. Alright, this guy is a spooky dude because he's got normals that are even better than ours. And he does ridiculous damage and has some crazy round start shenanigans. I think that we just... I was going to say back off there. Okay, I don't know when it's my turn there. Obviously. I thought that after he did the three swings and we blocked them, 
that he would have to at least do something there. Okay, he can beat that. Can he beat anything there? Let's try 6P'ing some of this pressure. I think that'll be part of our reasonable answers to this stuff, because right now, he's just, yeah, throwing out buttons that are bigger than ours and killing us in two hits. This is what I expected the first time we played into Goryuki. It didn't quite happen, but there we go. Let's see if we can turn this around a little bit. Oh, we didn't hit his jump with that. I'm so upset. Uh, we checked that with a really... We checked that with a really slow move. It was probably not the best option. Let's jump back and throw a fireball, shall we? See what his option is there. Alright. 2H, right? Okay, fair enough, fair enough. We deserve that, we deserve that. Wow, I just wanted to... I just wanted to do this. This was the... Oh, that doesn't hit from there. Okay. We're learning things. Okay, we can't do that, apparently. Fair enough. Alright, well, we went from getting smoked the first round to turning it into some, uh, to some rounds there. Played some games, so that wasn't too terrible. Oh, that was not what we wanted, and he's mashing. Okay. I feel like he's doing stuff that just loses to 6P, and he is. Is it too high of a blood to really, like, threaten my... Like, he's just going crazy, huh? Can we get the... No, we can't. I was trying to... Oh, what is... Was that a punish? It wasn't. Why didn't my super come out? Man, I am bad at the super input. Like, unreasonably bad at the super input. Okay, we'll take that. He just got a lot of blood. He can't really contest our uh, projectiles the way that he was able there that first time. Right, right, right. We gotta watch out for that. Okay, and that goes really far when he's in blood. Like, even farther than the level 3, which I guess makes sense, huh? Okay, so we're kind of learning. Like, we're losing to some stuff where it feels like we're in good positions when we kind of give them up without a fight. Okay. Wow, that move puts you so minus. Even though he messed up, I was, like, still not capable of getting out of there, huh? We're doing a burst this time. And he's just throwing out moves, huh? That was like all of his health. And now it's our turn to do the reversal super. What's up? Just gonna back off again. Alright. Okay, right, right, right. He's got big enough buttons that we need to actually play around that stuff over there. And I think that he actually has to recover there. If he was... <laughs> If it's possible for Nagoryuki to cancel the recovery of his uh, super there with the uh, timer running out on his Blood Rage, that would have been a spectacular attempt to be safe at the end of a YOLO super. I'm not sure how that works. We might look that up later and find out some answers. We didn't really get like a huge thing off of this, and we missed one of our... like The, the 6H was too far to hit... So we didn't get a hit there, and we have him set to block everything, which is no fun. We like hitting people. There we go. 
We did get a couple of good things. I guess if I get a counter hit and he's got bursts and I pay attention to that, I should probably just like... You jump forward, right? And then block. If I see the big, you know, the zoom in, slow down, base drop counter hits of this game, it, it is nice that they're visually clearing, clear in telling you, hey, you're about to die. But, uh, yeah, it does make for an interesting interaction with the burst, so I might try to do something like that if I can think about it while we're playing. But for the moment, we're at least at a point where, like, is this the same person? I wasn't paying attention to their name. Where, like, we're playing well enough and are familiar enough now with what's going on that I can kind of ask these questions and play at the same time, and that feels kind of nice. Like, we have a long way to go, and there's some things that I won't be able to talk and play at the same time, but this feels good. Yesterday felt good, too. Life, life is good. Um, I think we just go for, like, 5k sweep. Okay. I was trying to get away from that. That stuff is crazy, huh? Too slow. Fair. And he was just walking backwards. I actually tried to do the 2k the first time, and I got a 5k, so he blocked it. I think I might have been too far away, though, so I might have been saved. That works. We're okay with that. He just burnt, like, half of his blood and got basically nothing. Right, right, right. Okay, so... Do have to worry about that? I was trying to fuzzy jump that. There we go, like that. Ooh, I didn't get the... S Maybe that doesn't work. Maybe I have to do uh, th my a faster button there. Is he gonna pop? Okay, it's not a counter hit. We got lucky. It's not a counter hit. We have to do our best regular combo there. It's a lot of blood, sir. And we have to have our best punish on deck, right? Just Oh, we let a switch on him. Oh, we called it out, but we missed it. And, oh wow, that's very safe. He has very big disjoints, huh? He's scrapping. Alright, but we were able to find a spot where we could push a button there and we survived. Ugh, barely. <laughs> I don't that one I think was kind of the opposite. We did not deserve to win that one, but we did. Alright. Backdash fireball? Oh, that doesn't go far enough. I don't know what I could have done to really punish him there because I had already committed to the fireball. Fair. Oh, I thought I could do something cool there, but I was out of range. Okay, that's not fast enough. But at least we tried it. Oh, we're gonna get dunked. Yeah, that's fine. I think I could have still not pushed a button there. That's a lot of blood, sir. But just not quite enough to die, huh? Oh, wow. Okay, well, I was trying to be unburstable there. Okay, fair enough. Uh, we can start trying to throw some slightly uh, slower fireballs, huh? Alright, fair enough. He finally went for something there. Because then that makes us plus, and we're much more likely to be able to really punish him for that. Wow! Okay. That one was a counter. I don't understand. Wow, that move. Okay, I think that was slow enough that if I had pushed a fast button there, I would have won. But I can't be sure. So let's just keep going. Lots of questions to answer. 
It's kind of how it goes every time we get to a new matchup. I know, you know, just I've watched some top eights. I've seen Hotashi play this character. If he calls you out for any minuscule dumb thing, kills you, and then you only have half health in the next round because he kills you so hard that you die half your life in the next round after that. <laughs> so, you know. Okay, right. I have to remember he does that. Wow! I thought that I could do a 6H there after the burst and it would not be something he could do anything about. That still caught me. I'm so sad. Okay. Okay, he can't actually get close enough to, to do anything when he's that far away. Good to know. Right, right. I gotta be paying attention to that. Does this just punish him? I think it might. I looked really slow. It didn't say it, say it punished him, so it's hard to tell. I'm just gonna back off. Throw a fireball. Okay. He hasn't done too much blood stuff either. Okay, he's definitely caught onto that. We need to, like, six. Ooh, that countered my 6P. I thought we were gonna be pretty safe there, to be honest. I was feeling pretty good about that anti air. Until it didn't work. Hero burst! Yeah, we're dead already, lol. He's just literally holding. Is that like far slash or something? He's literally just holding space and pressing far slash, I guess. Our response to that is to try to whiff punish it. Oh, that didn't work and I got punished because I tried! No! Okay, we can do it at that range. Oh, interesting. He kind of has a way to just bully through all of that. was spaghetti, but it worked. I am not good at doing supers without just jumping like an idiot. Wow, that's just... It's unbelievable how often that happens. Like, even when we're stuck in uh, those super flashes and I have a lot of time, I gotta really work on that. Like, not jumping when I'm trying to get this, which does not go quite as far as I gave it credit for. I thought that I would be able to, like, hit Nagoriyuki there, but he's so disjointed that this huge, whatever this thing is, demon head, that, that doesn't hit his sword because the sword's too long. Wow. All right, well, we're learning things. Then we can chomp him through the wall there. All right, so... I guess that's kind of what we do on his blood rage. Or we can, like, I don't know. That, that seems like the thing that's fast enough to, to punish him. And if we're fast there, or if we're close enough there, even with a far slash, we can roam and cancel it, which is not something I've been doing when I have meter. Got to start working on that. And then, you know punish him if he's losing half his health in addition to a combo even a small combo right like that plus half your life is a lot of life is that my best option there I think it might be with how fast it has to be and then if we're farther away I mean we don't get a lot if we're farther away to be honest we kind of have to run in and hit him but I think if we don't get hit by the blast we can run in pretty far and still be pretty darn capable of attacking him. But if we hit, like we did not have enough uh, time to do the 6H. I tried that. That was too slow, so we'll have to keep on figuring stuff out there. But definitely that little basic combo. Alright, go Lewis. We're on a new thing. Alright, we just did the... What? Do you, what? <laughs> that move is crazy. Oh yeah, I was pretty sure that the... Well, that was too slow, whatever he did.
Okay, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Uh, are the are the behemoth typhoons in the air actually highs? I'm not sure. Like, you should probably be blocking high anyway, so I'm good glad that I was trying to do that at least. Wow! Oh, and we were too slow on our heavy fireball there. Okay, and he just kills us. Alright, so I do not know how to play against this character. He's got a bunch of swings. I know a couple of things. I know that the high and the low one that he can do are plus, but he's got like eight of them, and I... This is the first time I've played against this character, so like obviously we haven't labbed anything from him yet. Oh, he actually waited. We like waited and baited that, and it just did not matter. And we're gonna do the 6H? Oh, it's amazing. Alright, we just run up 2K. And there was supposed to be a fireball there that I failed to do the motion for. Alright. Uh, we're gonna go back and we're gonna fireball. Wow, that, uh, that far slash is kinda nuts, huh? Oh, that's a, that's a low. Alright, that does not look like a low. We are, like, somehow already dead. Oh, I think that caught my jump. I, I guess I... I was faultless defensing there, right? I was like, I got chipped out, but I have no idea how I died there, actually. Okay, that one is clearly plus. Okay, that one's plus. That one's not. Oh, but it's very, very, very fast. Like, I can't do a jab most of the time and get away with guessing wrong on a jump there, so. Ooh, that was unfortunate. Alright, so he definitely, like, his pressure is totally nuts. Like, you FD and block, and you don't get hit by anything, and you FD every single hit, and you've still taken 50% chip somehow. Alright, so if we just, like... Oh, oh, we were a little slow on it. Apparently, he's got a really good setup for timing that behemoth that he was doing there. I mean, like, <laughs> those moves are so fast. Wow. Can we beat someone with a, with a 6P, maybe? Use the, uh, what do they call it? The DLC low that's so... Oh, that was not a great trade for us, huh? Oh, that goes very far. Are we just dead? We're just dead. Alright, this is... We didn't learn a thing, to be honest. Except that Gold Lewis kills you from round start, and uh, you don't get a second chance. That's pretty much all we learned, is that Gold Lewis... So mokes you if you get hit and you do not appear to need to be nearly as good at managing things as you do with other characters that can do the same thing like uh, like the uh, Nagoryuki that we just played. He kind of just like did stuff that we've been able to beat with other characters where they flail buttons and we're like alright I got this but everything he does does 50% of your life in chip and then also is plus 50 so seemed hard that's definitely one of those, uh, like, if you don't know the matchup completely, he can just, like, even the most basic of uh, Gold Lewis's appear to be able to just knowledge check you, because if they don't know if it's plus, neither do you. That's how that goes, right? No, no, no. If they don't know what side they're on, there it is. But yeah, that's definitely what it felt like. It definitely felt like 
there wasn't a prayer. Like if I if I was playing the Gold Lewis and just spinning the stick and pressing the Typhoon buttons, I could have done to myself what he just did to me. That's what that felt like. Whether that's true or not is totally irrelevant. It just felt like there was nothing to learn because he was just kind of spinning the stick and winning. So we'll definitely have to look up that one later, but uh, I don't know what to do about that. I think we just accept that that's a bad matchup for a while because I can't be bothered to look at every single Behemoth Typhoon and remember every single one of the... Uh, unlucky. Pushed the wrong one there. Wow. Oh, I tried to punish that because he ran forward, right? Man, we are... Uh... What? What happened there? Oh, and we just barely didn't jump out of that, and he perfects us by seeing what we're doing and just punishing everything. Alright, we're just gonna far slash. Screw it. That's fine. Oh, I thought I was holding back. Oh yeah, that didn't kill me because he was in the air, and that kind of works. Oh, okay, that lagged. I was not trying to jump that way, but I was there, so I was like, well, I guess I gotta commit now. And it didn't matter, because it lagged. And if it lagged on his side like it did on mine, he had all the time in the universe to hit us with that. Alright, let's back off and throw a fireball. Okay, well he got really unlucky there. That should not have happened the way that it did, but it did. Oh, okay. Uh, is he gonna send us through the wall here? No, he's not. Ooh, too too fast. He countered my. F I'd, I'd PRC. He countered my invincible move that would have worked the first time I tried it, and it looked like it should have worked there. I guess it's, it is really slow though, huh? Okay, that catches back dashes. And we got. Yeah, you can't just wake up on that every single time. Like, come on now. You have to block eventually. I mean, we take that trade at this point. Uh, we wanted to go backwards there. I did not want to go forwards. Okay, and... We didn't quite get what we wanted there either, but it's fine. And he's just swinging, man. All right. Well, we got a little bit out of him there. Let's back dash and throw a fireball. That did not work. Oh, right, right. I probably could have done something better there. Uh, I was trying to be ready for it, but that is not plus, though, I don't think. Unless you're, uh, unless you're in the shock state, right? Okay, this time that's got to hit him, right? And he's just mashing in. I was sure there was going to be a DP there, which is why I was just waiting for it. I was going to respect the DP, because if he went for it... Okay, well, we're back to floor 8, apparently. Because if he went for it, then we would be in a good place. So, yeah. Yeah, sure. So, yeah, I feel pretty good. We might after this week consider just like staying on floor nine and it doesn't matter anymore we'll just stay there because that felt like the kind of stuff i needed to learn it definitely felt like when i'm playing on floor eight like a lot of times now it's it's a little slow right like you kind of see everything is happening nothing works like that kai was able to actually put enough mental stack on me that i couldn't do this not that i'm good at it to begin with but I've gotten a lot better at it, and I don't know that I hit him with a single 6P. Never tried to do, like, an air throw. So, you know, he was catching me with a bunch of stuff where I was trying to jump over it and backdash, 
And I was instead not hitting back fast enough, because I wanted to jump forward over it and then backdash to lose as little space as possible. Which is why I don't want to just like jump straight up and backdash. Like, yes, I could do that, but it gives me less space to get over that giant fireball, and it also um, gives him more space to do stuff. So it shortens my window of where I can land, and it gives him more space to take from me. I wasn't paying attention to whether or not I could teleport behind him when he was doing that at any point in time. He might have been good enough to have always seen that, though. I don't know. But yeah, yeah that one was a little bit more like that was pushing the edge of my abilities, but it wasn't past them. Okay, this person is really good. They just did a 6P. I can tell that they're really good. No. Wow, the way that they were able to just reversal that situation so easily. Wait, oh, oh, the scythe throw part of it. The scythe throw part of it actually activates the thing. Oh, oh, it just disappeared, lol. Oh, and that catches me. You just can't do that. Even when I'm just trying to like reposition a little bit, it's so easy for people to just accidentally hit backdashes in this game. I am not used. This is a dumb matchup. I don't like this matchup at all. Can we like push in on him here? And it's really hard, huh? Wow, I didn't realize what I was doing to people all this time. This is miserable. Like, the fact that you can break each other's fireballs makes this really an issue. That backdash, though, huh? Okay, but now we've seen that from them. And we are just not blocking in spots where we ought to be blocking. Like our opponent was really good at, like, if they get the the fireball on you, you just throw a fireball. Wow, we almost didn't get that. I was, like, struggling. All right, we'll take that. I was trying to do block stuff. Oh, that just works though, right? No, it doesn't. All right, there we go. Got a little something back there. Okay, we're sort of figuring out how this works. Oh, that caught my fireball before I could do it, huh? I felt bad of him to, like, give up that position there. I think it worked out, he kind of got it back, but he had to fight for it. Okay, he did He did pay attention to what I was doing, and we should be... Alright, we're alive for some reason, because he decided not to super us. Love it. Wow, even when you're plus, you can't do that, huh? I felt like that should stop that. Maybe I'm wrong. It definitely feels like I'm getting way, like, hyper out fireballed here. You gotta, like, get your crows on this guy in entirely different ways. You can't just, like, okay, I will happily play this game as long as my stain is up so that you can't get a stupid little thing next to me and then blow me away for it. Wow, it's so hard. Yeah, this person's kind of like me, but that like that 6P was a I should have 6P'd you 6P, like what I do to try to remember. All right. All right. So how does one play this game? It's like second one is better.
No, and then the DP. Okay, fair enough. Yeah, this is a, this is a nightmare matchup. All right. Yeah, the uh, the fact that you can kill each other's fireballs is just ridiculously obnoxious. Look at how obnoxious this is. Really lucky trade from them there. I do see the attempts to trade a lot, and look at how often it works against the the stain pressure when I'm trying to get in like that. It, it didn't do the fireball. He wasn't ready. That was that is one part of this matchup that I've learned a little bit from TFH, which is at least at low levels, throwing the uh... oh okay I was thinking that that would catch anything he tried to do and I was trying to stop that from hitting me. Okay, we gave up space there for no real good reason, huh? Oh, I had stain. I didn't even realize it. All right, we're sort of figuring this out, but man, that is a nightmare. All right, we got there. <laughs> Oof. All right, we're sort of figuring that out, but the the fireballs beating the fireballs was I was not ready for that at the beginning. That is awful. <laughs> All right, well that was an interesting like self reflection moment right there. We learned some things about ourselves. We also learned how god awful that matchup is. Like I guess you kind of just like fireball forward and take up space and if they throw fireballs then you take that space up by throwing your own fireball and canceling theirs and taking the space and that's how you is that how you neutral in this game in that matchup and here we go i don't even know the mirror matchup for my own character all right well i think that that's probably good for today at least for the stuff i record uh, we'll just keep going. Uh, seems like we're still basically floor 8, give or take, but I do feel better, right? I definitely feel like I can adapt in the middle of a match slightly better and learn as I go, even against characters that I know nothing about. And, you know, on a couple of them, we got smoked a few times and then we turned it around, except that Gold Lewis. I think it is a combination of that Gold Lewis being phenomenally better than us. Uh, and just not knowing the matchup in a matchup where even the lowest level players kill you in two hits. So, you know, since I can't do that in return, like Testament might be able to, but I can't. Uh, it was just, uh, it was just a slaughter. <laughs> like, I don't know how to get out of that pressure, man. All right, well, this was an interesting one. This is pretty fun. We're getting to a spot where I'm feeling pretty happy about things. And, uh, we'll just keep going. I will, uh, run another one tomorrow, and I hope to see you there.